Hello, Destinites, and welcome to this week's Zur Exotics Location and Review. And he's over here. He has shown up in the tower. Tis the weekend to have awesome fat loots because I've checked out what he had on him. And I'm pretty sure they're all exceptional. And it doesn't matter. Like it's He's got a great variety this time, especially too, for whether it is you want PvE or PvP. You're going to broaden out the arsenal today if you can afford all of them for every single aspect to play. So... Let's begin here. We're weighing in immediately with no backup plans. This would be an absolute beast in PvP. And it would be useful it would be useful in PvE as well. Shotgun kills trigger force barrier and force barrier's duration is increased. That's amazing. That's just like for upfront gritty fighting, that's gonna be awesome. Um, and you've got a great option here. Um, Rain blows increase melee attack speed really really good in PvP or this other option is exceptional for P PvE bonus grenade energy on melee hits grenades so you can of course take out a lot more of the adds then you've gotten increased reload speed of shotguns if that doesn't complement your PvP nothing else will uh, and increase reload speed of machine guns I think you would probably go for the special here but you want to get this this is an amazing grab. He's uh, he's packing some heat. So definitely grab the backup plans for your Titan. Right here, this one I can't wait to use a little bit because it unlocks basically one of my favorite weapon perks for free. Or not for free, I mean it occupies a slot for your hunter, but its radar remains visible while aiming primary weapons. This is third eye. This is third eye that you'll find on things like the inward lamp or on Nerwin's Mercy. And this in the Crucible is just amazing. You can anticipate and engagements, and before an opponent has come around the corner, you can be shooting at them at exactly the right moment. So that's it's a no-brainer. It's awesome. It's going to be great in PvP. Not so much, well, actually, not at all in PvE. You don't care how absolutely accurate you are with your radar while aiming down the sights during PvE. But PvP, awesome. Not to mention this flashy, sweet graphic that you got here for this, like, uh, radar that's going on. Uh, then you got your standard stat bonuses right here. You've got inverse shadow, increased super energy gain from killing minions of darkness. That's all right for PvE. And this as well is good for PvE. So I guess that's a little bit of a balance. The, each of these are good for PvE, although the exotic perk isn't. I, w I wouldn't equip this, though. Highly recommend you don't equip this for PvE. Uh, shield starts recovery immediately after orb pickup. Great for PvP again. Say you're in Trials of Osiris, somebody pops their super, you're weak, but they uh, drop an orb and you start to heal. So really, really good. Knucklehead Radar is a big buy. You're definitely going to want that. We have a great here. The Apotheosis Veil is kind of a... It's, it's multi-purpose, but I could see... I don't know the mechanics how this gets implemented. I'm sure if you looked up people abusing this, you'd find it was really, really useful. It just, it can't not be. Immediate health, uh, regenerate health, melee, and grenade energy upon activating your super. So you j you go on a tear when you activate this. You, you suddenly, everything is rejuvenated as soon as you activate it. And I don't know a situation that you're going to be in that that isn't useful, especially if that health regen is kicking in when you activate your super in a really tight spot not only do you get your super which makes you you know more resilient you're not going to take damage as easily uh, but you're going to have your super to use with a bunch of health because it's regenerating uh, general stats again and then you've got inverse shadow again good for PvE you've got second thoughts gain bonus super energy from special weapon kills both PvE uh, and all around pretty good PvE, I would say, to have all these things going back up. It's going to save you when you're near death, so you don't need to wipe if that's happening. And then finally, Infusion replenishes health each time you pick up an Orb of Light. Good for PvP, good for PvE. I would say it lends itself to PvP, but it's not bad in PvE. You know, this gets you out of a tight spot. And then last but not least, this awesome heavy weapon. The uh, the Dragon's Breath is just badass. Release trigger after weapon fire to drop solar damage napalm canister. So, and effectively, it's a AoE effect. Not that you don't have an AoE effect, large blast radius in the first place with a rocket launcher, but then it makes an area that it's hit impassable afterwards. That's amazing. Um, expect to find more ammo for this weapon. That's good for PvE, not so much the PvP. Uh, quick draw, good in the PvP if you want to be aggressive. Javelin, velocity is fantastic. 
Reload, not such a big deal because you generally expect to take him out on your first hits with your rocket launcher. So I would probably lend myself towards the javelin or the quick draw. And then finally, who's next? A kill with the final round in the magazine increases reload speed. So that almost, that takes care of the speed reload. So I would definitely choose one of these two if you're going to go with this weapon. Yeah, awesome. And it's got this kind of old school, my buddy was saying it's some old um, American war plane that it's kind of reminiscent of, but really, really cool art design on that. So there you go, that's Zer for this week. Don't forget if you got some extras to pick up the uh, three of coins, that's always good in your uh, heroic strikes or whenever you're killing an ultra. And that is my review. He's packing some awesome stuff and you should grab it all. And we're probably all the guardians are in a bit of a surplus because they gave out that free 20 coins. So hopefully you can, I certainly did. And that's the Great Owls weekly update for Zer. Signing off for now. Please do like, subscribe and share if you find the video useful. Peace.